hey you guys and welcome back to another video today is day one of the bathroom makeover let me give you guys a little sh quick rundown of what it look it's looking like now we're gonna hop right into it right, y'all so this is the very tiny <laughs> bathroom now hope you guys can get a good look at it when you see this ugly color i hate this color um so this is the bathroom now you guys so for now of course you guys know eventually i want to pull this tub out but that's probably gonna be something that's not gonna happen this year um and of course change all this tile out on the floor here and here but for now this is gonna be like a temporary like a refresh so first thing we're gonna do is finish i'm gonna give another coat on this um on these holes so I can, it can be smooth i'm gonna go ahead and paint everything white take this bar down and i'm going to tape everything out first as well so let me go ahead and get to doing that but this is what it's looking like you guys on day one all right you guys let me go ahead and tape everything out oh yeah i hope y'all can see it's a tiny it's extremely tiny in here so hope you guys can get a good look but i'm going to try to tape off as much as i can on camera. Today is day two of the bathroom. Day two and hopefully the last day of the bathroom refresh. Let me show you guys what the white paint is looking like. Y'all, it looks so good. I need to do one more coat. Because this paint was so hard to cover. One more coat. And then we can go ahead and do the fun stuff with just like the decorating. So, let me go ahead and do one more coat. I'm going to let it dry for about an hour or two. And then we're going to come in and get everything, get the tub and everything a good clean wipe down. And then we're going to go ahead and put all the decor, all the final touches to it. So I'm super excited about that. So let me go ahead and get that done. The second coat, I mean the, actually this will be the third coat done. And, uh, but it looks so good, y'all. So much more bright and airy with the white. Um, yeah. So let me go ahead and get the second, going the third coat done and then we'll go ahead and do the fun part which is decorating which is super excited so let me get that done i'll be back in a couple hours all right you guys so the paint is done it looks so freaking good too <clears throat> like it's all white i've already cleaned the shower and a toilet and all of that good stuff and i actually tightened my toilet too but my toilet was loose so it, all of this has been painted now i'm gonna go ahead and take the tape off you guys and then I'm gonna take this shower curtain now. I was gonna originally try to spray paint this, but I think I'm just gonna go and buy a new one real quick from Home Goods. 
I think anyway. I'm gonna because I don't think I have any black spray paint. Let me see if I have any black spray paint outside. If I do, I'll reuse that one. If not, I'm gonna go ahead and just run and grab a new shower rod. And then we'll do the little DIY on the shower curtain as well. But it looks so freaking good, y'all. The paint it looks so much brighter and lighter in here. All right, so let me take the tape down real quick. Alright y'all, so I do have some black spray paint, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this shower rod down and I'm going to take it outside and spray paint on it. So this is what it looks like now. It's all rusty too. I'm gonna take it outside and spray paint black, y'all. guys all right so i have the hooks that i showed you guys there in the previous clip i think the bar I mean the shower rod is dry so i'm gonna go outside and grab that but let me show you guys up this shower curtain hey let me grab my shower curtain All right, so you take two shower curtains and you connect them together. You cut it and connect it together to make it longer. So what I need to do is first um, determine how long I need it to be. So let me see.
blow your mind, baby So come give me love I never felt nothing quite like this I get a high every time we kiss Can't get enough, babe So come give me love All of your love, don't you love me too? Now show me what it's about Love me till the morning Love me in the evening You know what I want All of your love And you guys And this Is the Final Refresh you guys Looks so freaking good This little cabinet I have all of my little stuff organized, like extra tissue, my scrub, bath salt, my feminine products. These are like my little pre-packed, like little person out here throwing my bag. I have like my shower caps. That's here. And you guys can see my little DIY shower curtain. That looks here. <laughs> yeah. I bought this from Five and Below. I already had that. I had these hooks left over from the laundry room makeover. And then these pictures came from Hobby Lobby. But yeah, it looks so good. So clean and fresh. I went to take a shower and then I just, of course, I had my little pillow. And then I did gave everything a good clean in here. Yep. So, I'm gonna have to end up getting another shower curtain because you guys can see. Like, you see, the zoom in. I didn't get it spray painted good, and then now when I start moving around, it scratches up. So, I'm gonna have to get a new, an actual black shower curtain, but for now it'll do. But yeah, it looks so good. And I'm sorry I can't get a better angle, y'all, but this spare room is so tiny, so it's really hard to get a good angle in here but it looks good for now to end the video here thank you guys so much for watching let me know what you guys think about the bathroom kind of refresh i know we didn't make a lot of major changes like i told you guys i'm planning on gutting that bathroom soon um hopefully sometime beginning of next year so it's going to get like a full overhaul but for now i need to get that paint out of there and just give it like a fresh coat and just kind of make it more usable and functional right now for us but yeah let me know in the comments below what you guys think about the refresh in the bathroom total cost was about 120 dollars uh the major cost was just that cabinet i think it was about 100 dollars off amazon and then the rest like the little miscellaneous stuff that i had to purchase most of the stuff i kind of repurposed and i diy so i didn't really have to spend a lot of money and honestly i ended up using that um, credit I had from Amazon to purchase a cabinet, so I really didn't really come out of pocket for pretty, pretty much anything um, for the makeup. But yeah, let me know in the comments below what you guys think about the overall refresh, and I'll catch you guys on my next one. Bye. Hey.